Yep guys, welcome to my channel. It's Ron Xblade and in today's video I will show you how you can make like rig your model in Recon 4D. So here let's open the app and I just noticed that I can't add my OBJ models in Recon 4D because in my phone it's crashing every time I adding any trying to add any OBJ model. So let's make our model by ourselves. So here I will add a, a simple let's add a cylinder and I just and while I try to rig sometimes uh, before before start recording so while rigging I noticed that you can't change your OBJ yeah I mean models shape like if you change the model shape like this then when you try to rig and uh, like change the rig I mean animate the rig it will be look like a little weird so don't let your just don't change the shape let your model keep his shape and change while in edit mode so in edit mode you can change your model shape it doesn't matter just don't change the transform so here i will drag this up here and let's extrude it will made a little hand and then rig the hand so i'll make it a little smaller like little down here again extrude this and again a little smaller let's extrude it again up here and make it smaller like this and here we will have the bend here so let's but first i will just drag it fully up here and drag the smaller part here and make it smaller like this and here we will add little cuts here one cut another cut will be here like this and the next cut will be here and let let's make this one bigger like this okay this will be enough and let's add some more cuts like here one and here two and now how to rig the model so let's go to object mode and while selecting your like you have to select your model for obj i mean model first then go to add add section here you will see like bones but first like as its origin point is here i will drag it here and I want to set the origin point here to here so let now I will go to edit mode and select all the mesh and drag the mesh down here now if I go to object mode I have the origin point here so now let's select your model go to add and here you will see a bone so click on the bone oh it showing that invalid mesh data recalculate recalculate mesh so how to do that you have to click on your model then go to object mode here you will see a option called recalculate you have to click on the recalculate then your model will be recalculated like this i mean what's wrong with this now object mode recalculate yeah process one free so now it's re recalculated so go to again select your object go to add go to bones here you we, we we have a bone let's go to transform and change the location zero for all things i will set the location to zero and also here so it will come to the origin point now we have to 
right never mind now let's rotate it to down here i will see the transform minus 90 degrees okay yeah now let's copy this action denied so we have to add again a bone here now if i go to this drag it here we have a bone here like one here and you can see this by edit mode that where you have putting your bones then you have to go again object mode to use the bone again and if you don't want to drag your bone this to this you just again click on the object and again add a bone so you have you will have a another bone that is not like drag to it but in prisma 3d like parenting bones are very easy but here you will have some troubles like now if i want to uh, parent this bone with this bone so i will just have to select this bone go to hierarchy find where is my bone like this bone is here and this bone is this. so i will click this bone go to parent and click this bone but this parenting options just works with the objects but not with bones so you just if you want your bone to parent with other bone you you have to select your bone before you adding another bone in which bone you have selected then you if you add bones the other bone will be automatically parented with the previous bone that you have selected so here we added the bones and if you know we have a like wet painting option in uh, recon 4d so how to wet paint there if you click on the object i mean the bone then you will see the object section here and here are ik joints and here also bend here you can see bend and this is paint if you click on the paint you will have the paint option but here paint options only works on the point that you have in your object but your point won't be showing the here you have to like paint here and all the points will be shown here but it will be like it's very i don't know why but uh, wet painting i don't uh, really <laughs> like use this method because here are some problems like you have to calculate all the things that you have to want in your bend like now i have selected this point so if i rotated my this bone so only these points will be rotated with this but as you know if i rotate this bone this part all part down here should be rotated with this this so that's why i will need to like select all the points from here and this is also a good like a good feature for 3d like you know what i want to mean what i mean you already know that so here anyways if and now i have painted all the weights so here after wet painting you have to again click on the wet paint and now if you like rotate this won't work yet why because you didn't attach your bone to your object so how to do that click on the object go to object mode and here you will be see a option named detached if you click on the detached it's now showing that attached so this is the armature for like boning so if now i here you can see if i am now rotating the bone and also the hand is rotating like the uh, rigging is complete and as you know i previously like wet painted with this bone here all all the steps here like points if now i now rotate my like this you can see this is for wet paint and you have to you have to be very careful while while weight painting so that's why i don't use weight painting that much because you have to calculate very much and if you uh, like learn weight painting uh, normally if you learn it it will be be very helpful to you so and as i like my weight painting is not 
completed that time so how to like now how to go to normal like like this here is the normal word painting so how to delete my previous weight painting so again go to your bone click object and here you will see delete weights so click on the this and your all weight painting will be lost why this happening let's detach my object now it's okay and again go to your bone and click delete weight and now again click on your like objects yeah it's not working so click on your object go to here and click on detach to attach now it's attached and again let's change rotation of our bones not working it's working but it's not so go to our object click all the delete weights i will delete all bones weights here and now i'll just go to object and here we have to auto weights click on auto weights then it will be weight automatically now attach and now if i rotate this bone yeah it's working also this so this is the basic way i show you in how to rig in recon 4d but if you like learn how to use weight painting it will be very useful to you and i don't know how to use weight painting yet because it's like a little complicated to like you have to you uh, you have to select all the dots here but it will be easy if ne maybe next update you can show while weight painting all the dots here like which dot you have to want to select and which are not and this is the problem i faced while auto uh, weight painting so let's hope it will be fixed in next update and so this is how you can uh, like rig in recon 4d and if you like the video you know what to do and we will meet again in the next video bye